Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I am starting a new haul video. I just got this delivered from Paceable, which is my K Addy. Uh, I am going to be focusing mostly on JK merch, but there is also some new jeans stuff in here, but I'm going to do a completely separate new jeans video for this stuff. I'm gonna unpack the box right now, give you a little preview of what is to come in other videos. So that is new jeans new jeans i decided to go for new jeans season's greetings this year instead because bts didn't have one very exciting the golden jacket i'm actually quite surprised that this fits in such a small amount of space i have taken my name off of everything jimin's production diary i actually don't know what this is um when it asked me to fill out the customs form i saw this package and i was just like what is this it says key ring on it um yeah these last two ones this one's from uh, Selena in Korea, she did a go for all of JK's lucky drawers, so that is so exciting. And then this one also, I didn't know what to fill out on the customs form. It looks like it's a PC, so I'm interested. It says something about new jeans, so I think maybe Hive forgot to include something, but that intrigues me so much. You'll see this in the new jeans video. It is empty, let's go. We are actually gonna start with the photo cards because I'm so excited to look through these and like sleeve them and put them away. And oh, 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 hello there. Look at this fat, chunky stack. I ordered these through Selena in Korea. This is the only class I ordered through them because I actually did find another person that wasn't charging so many fees and they are being sent out from them tomorrow, which is also very exciting. But uh, these look to be little freebies that they've included at the front here, which, okay. I. Oh, that's pretty cool. But this is Soundwave Power Station and M2U in this. And then it's like a hell of a lot of album PCs. But let's look at these little cars that they have included at the start. Oh my goodness. Oh wow, these are so high quality. JK in bed, excuse me. Oh, this is upside down. Wow. Ah, I really like these. These are like credit card material. And then there is this one. These are like all little JK live moments. Oh, more JK in bed. Today, uh, they actually graduated from the military camp. So they are now in just like service. Don't know where they are serving, but I'm so glad that they're out of the camp and they can actually like start their work. Oh, I think it worked out to be that we're a 16th of the way through currently. Oh, this one's really cute. Thank you so much for these. These are really, really nice. I don't know how they made them, uh, but these are the cards that I ordered from them. So they included all of the album PCs that they pulled from the album. So I'm going to have so many of these left over. I actually don't know what to do with these. I have seen other people like make binders or the spare PCs that they have. But if you're interested in any of these cards, let me know. I might just sell them for like two bucks if you want one. Yeah, just message me on Instagram and... I can organize something because I just have so many cards and I'm not really interested in making a mini binder of the PC. So, so that is all the random cards that you could get in Golden. Or, or I may do a giveaway, so I'll organize something to do with those. These are all of the Lucky Jaws. They really, really said, you need to buy this album. Uh, yeah, they had so many Lucky Jaws for Golden. I'll go through them one by one. I'm not sure which one is which store. But this is the first one. I'm really surprised by the actual like thickness of the card. I thought it may have been Lucky Draw material, but it is just the paper. It is shiny on the back, shiny on the front. This one is actually not great picture quality. You can see like the diamond pattern if you really, really zoom in. So then you can pick whether or not it is a fake or official card if you're wondering. But yeah, this one looks to not be great printing quality i do have the flash on my phone so the lighting might be a little bit odd but yeah this one has a cream background the borders are very much in line and then it has the little hive logo down here very cool very nice next up is this one i'll try and do it quickly though sorry <laughs> but i'm so excited to receive these he's doing the little 3d pose and then it's got his little piercings oh my goodness so many everywhere it'll be interesting when he comes back from the military to see how many of the piercings made it through the military whether or not they closed up a lot of the cards are like selfies there are so many selfies if you're a selfie collector this is definitely your dream come true oh my goodness 
the 3D look. This is one of my favorite lucky drawers that they produced. This one's definitely better picture quality than the others. He just looks so badass with all of the piercings. Although when he took them out to do the little thing with, um, the little thing, oh my goodness, the standing next to you thing with Usher, he actually looked, he, he looked very, very cool. There we go, there's another one. Oh, he's wearing no shirt. <laughs> this is from the Dazed uh, magazine shoot. So yes, it's pretty cool how they made everything kind of like a documentation of all of the promotions that he did. Uh, this one is from the American promotions, like where he performed by the water. And this one has a green background. So I'm going to have to work out how these look in my binder. But he's doing a little, little pouty pose. Iconic. I do wish that they did have some like PCs from the actual music video though. I have said that quite a lot before. This is from a um, performance that he did on one of the Korean broadcast shows. This outfit. His hair is a little bit longer there. Yeah, if they do any more PCs, which I don't think that they will, um, maybe for the documentary. I hope that we get some for the um, really short hair, the Usher kind of music video look. This one has a blue line in the background. As I said, I'm going to have to like work out how I store these, especially with the colors on the back. I do care about the colors on the back. I thought that was like a mark, but it's just part of the photo. Uh, a couple of the cards do really, really match with each other though. Like this one matches with another lucky draw, this outfit, the BB look. This is a practice outfit with his slightly longer hair. So cute. I'm really, really happy with the quality of the PCs. I am getting fingerprints on them though. I just had a shower, so my hands are a little bit hot. I definitely don't want to get fingerprints on them. Thank you, Selena Ring Korea, for not getting fingerprints on them. Thank you. I really, really appreciate that. This is another one of my favorites. He looks so cool. And this is going into the blue back set. Again, still the same material. They seem to not have any stem cuts, if you're wondering. Nothing at all. But this has slightly longer hair again. Oh, <laughs> he's definitely got his favorite, like, pose that he likes to do the peace sign and the pouty <laughs> and then this one's another 3d one so it would have been cool to put all the 3d ones together but again i want the backs to match so there is this one they must have just said to him hey take a selfie take a selfie take a selfie every two seconds cute i really like that one as well the the other one i was talking about yeah in the bb shirt bb in the little practice room and that's the last blue one. I do appreciate how the borders are very centered. Yeah, that's pretty nice. Okay, that is all of the lucky draws. So many lucky draws. Thank you so, so much, Selena Ring Korea. Um, you were very efficient. You were just, um, yeah, amazing. And so willing to send to Kay Addy. So I really, really appreciate that. I'll do another small package while I am zoomed in. This is another merch drop that they did on Weverse that I was just like, why are we doing this now? But these are another set of like concept kind of cards. I'm thinking that these are like their equivalent of Armypedia kind of things that they're doing now. Uh, but these are bookmarks, not postcards, unlike the B one that they released and the Love Yourself Answer ones that they released. So kind of a different shape, which I'm unsure about how I will store these. I might have to create some custom pages again. But this one is in proof concept, which like, I'm just happy that we didn't get more of the, is this? That actually might be the door concept, but it's not the light door concept, so I'm, I'm okay with it. If we got one more thing in the door concept, I would probably scream. These are, as I said, bookmarks. And then, oh! BTS proof bookmark. Is that the bookmark? Okay, not what I was expecting. I thought it was going to be that shape on the inside, and that was going to be the PC. That is so odd. That is odd. That is not a bookmark. I would not use that as a bookmark. Uh, this is the photo card that you could get with it. It is matte, matte, kind of similar to the Bastion's PCs, very similar to the broadcast card. So if you don't want to splurge on the broadcast card, probably just get this. And then this is the bookmark. It is longer. It's kind of like Stray Kids length. So hopefully I can use, oh, <laughs> hopefully I can use those sleeves that I have. It's a 3D one. Oh, I don't know that I like this. I feel like it's just a money grab. 
It is thicker material, but yeah, I ordered this when I was down in Melbourne with Maddie. <laughs> Any opportunity to just mention Maddie, I miss her so much. Um, yeah, I was in the car and she didn't order it. And I was like, well, I'm going to order it. <laughs> uh, and then this is the other one, which is also proof. Yeah, so random. What are they doing? What is this? And then this is the PC that it came with. Again, in this concept, let's move on from this concept. I mean, we can't really move on from it, can we? Because BTS as a group are not going to release an album for a little while. So, oh no. <laughs> Hopefully this is the last of it. If we get one more things in these, I'll eat my shorts. This is the bookmark. <laughs> okay. I mean, we are going to get a vinyl soon. So that's kind of exciting to see what those PCs will look like. I like this one better. He looks a bit more like 3D in this. 3D. The next little item is this one. This is not JK focused. Uh, I did say that I had some other stuff in this package that just made it into the box and this is so this is so exciting you do not understand if you watched my singapore vlog i'll put it up here i absolutely love that video if you ever want to like watch one of my vlogs i really really enjoy making them i lined up for and i didn't get it while i was in singapore for august d and I was a little bit devastated, but at the same time, like people had been lining up from like the night beforehand. And then the resale price on these was so expensive. So when they dropped these on Weverse, I was like, yoink, that you are mine. I was so bloody excited that they released these. I do feel a bit like bad for the people that did line up like overnight and bought them for a lot of money on resale, but I'm... I'm really, I'm really, really happy. Uh, it says Sugar Auguste Tour D-Day Guitar Pick Set Singapore. This is the show that I did go to, but this is the pick set. I am so excited. It, people lined up overnight because they had such limited qualities of these at every single stop that he did. 50 to 100 of these per stop. I want to touch it. <laughs> it opens very simply. The packaging is a little bit warped. It sat in my K-Addy for so long. It took forever for them to send this out, actually. Oh my goodness, I just... Ah. It doesn't come with like a, a little chain to put this on. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I bought the earrings as well from this tour and it's one of my favorite things that I've ever purchased. <laughs> like everyone comes back before BTS like debut date june 13th except for yoongi so i hope that he's like gathering up his holiday dates and he can come back at the same time okay this is the little pic it says sugar august d tour d day in singapore looks to be in fairly good quality oh back has nothing and it is yeah a guitar pick oh very sturdy guitar pick and then this is the little necklace that it also came with and it's kind of in like the Dalmajang theme, I feel. It doesn't have any plastic on the front that I can tell. And then this is the back and it says Sugar Auguste. And it is a bit of a thick, thicker material. And yeah, it's plastic, this. That's pretty cool. I really like that. You could probably put it on a necklace. It is a bit like chunky though. I don't think that I would wear it. That's super cool. I'm so happy to own that. That's really pretty. <laughs> yeah. I just realized that it wasn't filming and I did fully unbox this. I'm really sad. So I'm going to unbox it again. This was Jimin's production diary POB set. Uh, if you ordered his documentary series. And I still so, so regret not getting a J-Hopes set for this. But this is the little set that they released. This is so cool. It was so cool to watch the artistry at work and, the, and just the amazing work that he put into his album so we have a little postcard here this is a really nice postcard it's matte and the paper seems really nice material it's very similar to j-hopes if if anyone sees j-hopes for a good price resell or have it and don't want it <laughs> let me know because i would love to purchase his set i should have just purchased it but i i just skipped over it kind of like how i didn't order uh jimin's vinyl and i probably won't order tay's either i'll definitely get dido don't question D-Day. D-Day is still my favorite solo album that has come out. I'm trying to save a bit more money after Golden so I didn't end up ordering 
yeah, Jimin's vinyl. And I saw that one of the PCs was very similar. Little stickers. So cute, so cute. This is going to muck with my setup a little bit. It truly is because I thought that I was done with face. But these are three cards. Oh, that one's so stunning. Luscious lips. Oh, the little coconut bowl cut. There we go. It is matte on the back and then shiny on the front. These are really nice high quality cards. That like whole set was really nice quality. We're going to move on to some more JK items. And I did consider not purchasing these when I saw the price because they seem to always put the photo cards with the bulky items and the things that are expensive to ship slash buy. For the golden merch, they had two photo cards that you could get of JK and it came with this bulky jacket. On first look, really, really honestly did and do like until I showed other people and they said it looked tacky. So I will show like footage of me wearing it and me deciding whether or not to keep it or sell it on. The other item was a was a bag and I was, okay, I was just, I'll just show them. I'll start off with the bag, which is definitely my favorite item of the two. There was so much like other merch, but I'm a photo card collector, so I focused on that. And of course, like the photo cards that I've had to purchase so far have been, it, it's been uh, expensive. If you look at the front here, it says golden shoulder bag BKF and it has the little Hybe logo. Uh, let's open it up. It feels quite soft. Oh, it is a nice material. Yes. Oh, the photo. Let's look at it after. Oh my goodness. Wow. It's so soft. I did not expect it to be this like plush. I thought it would be like a really, really thin material, like a canvas material. It says golden. Oh, I'm keeping this. I'm so excited. Here is the back. It's kind of like a puffer jacket material. Here is the zip. It is in silver, which is surprising because I feel like they've been focusing a lot on the gold kind of aesthetics too. <gasps> Look at the color on the inside. Oh, it's like a muted gold. It says 3D7 standing next to you. Can you guys see okay? I might have to zoom out a little bit. It'd be a really nice overnight bag or like a gym bag. I will say that this is smaller than my normal overnight bag, but it is definitely a really nice size. The zip is smooth. It has a little pocket on the inside if you want to put some extra stuff in there. Wow, I am very, very impressed. I'm very happy with the quality of the material. Here is the strap, which is the main focal point of the bag. So it has kind of like this, what's it called? Like rock climbing. And it is silver again. It says golden. And you can screw this down. And then it'll be latched up or you can screw it back up. I actually thought that would unlatch it. And then you can push it in and it'll release the bag. But such a cool detail. I just looked up what this is called, a carabiner. It's so soft and plush. I feel like you could get some pools in it though, but that is definitely worth it, this. I just realized that I didn't have my flash on my phone. I'm gonna turn it back on. This is mine, I'm keeping this. This wasn't that expensive. I'm so happy with it. And then this is the photo card that it came with. Always the flimsy, flimsy paper they use for these. Here is the back, it is mini PC sized. Here is the front, he's so cute. This is my favorite of the two cards. It is square corners, as I said, so very flimsy. You would have to hope that they are so careful with packaging the bag in order to not get this damage to you because they do just chuck it in there, but he's doing his peace sign and it is green on the back. Oh, so cute, it's so cute. Okay, and now finally we are on to the big one, the jacket. The box that I actually sent from my K Addy wasn't that expensive to ship to me, which very much surprised me. The jacket feels quite light, so I thought that it may have actually been vacuum sealed, but it is not. Um, did I leave the PC in there? Where did it go? Oh, the PC is not damaged. Oversized bomber jacket. Oh my goodness. It is the exact same material as the bag. 
this is the price that this jacket was. It is definitely not the cheapest thing. And as soon as I saw it, I was like, what am I going to do? And I did definitely consider not purchasing it because I was like, this is going to be so expensive to ship to me. And it just, it is definitely an investment. It is, I was really, really hoping that it was going to be very high quality to make it definitely worth it. Because some of the merch that Hybe releases is definitely not worth the money, especially the clothing. It's normally pretty flimsy. This looks really nice. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Oh no. Oh no. I might have to move to my floor. It's really big. Oh, you can see my tripod. I'm sorry. <laughs> this is just so big. The amazing thing about this jacket is that it is reversible. This side is the black side. It is very similar to a jacket that I actually do own. It really, really doesn't want to focus on it. Sorry. It is very plush. It is definitely a winter jacket. Very thick. Uh, looking here, it has pockets, quite deep pockets. The stitching is all very well done. As I said, it is the same material as the bag. Oh, is this a little pocket? It has little pockets on the sleeve. Oh, such heavy duty. Yeah, little pocket on the sleeve. Only on one sleeve though. If I turn it over, there is only a little kind of symbol on the back very subtle merch again which i'm a massive fan of so there is the word golden on the back of the neck the stretchy material going around the top and then it also has the stretchy material going around the bottom let's turn it inside out because i can see the details in here um, this is the part that people are like it's tacky so i'm gonna have to see whether or not i like it on me this is the zipper it says jungkook and then on the other side jungkook it's a chunky zipper. Chunky, chunky. I'm really happy that they went with the muted gold, not like a bright in your face gold. So if you turn it inside out, it is the track list. There it is. I'm sorry if you see my knee in this at any time. It's not embroidered on there. It's kind of like just printed, but it's really, really soft to touch. I would be very, very scared to wash it. I would definitely not. I wouldn't do it. Just hold your sweat in. I don't think it's tacky. I think it looks pretty darn awesome. I'd probably wear the black side a bit more. Nice detail on the pockets here is that you get a little button on this side, whereas the other side you did not get a button. So yes. Oh, and it's a little metallic button. I am completely blown away by this jacket and also the bag. The material is so much better than I expected. It is definitely worth the money. This feels like a luxurious, high quality brand jacket. This may be why they haven't had another merch shop because I feel like this could be quite expensive to make. Like the stitching is pretty, very nice. I did go for the medium. So it could have been a gamble to order some clothing merch from High because they are a bit of hit and miss. But this is definitely head and shoulders above anything I have ever ordered from them. For the price point, it better have been. So yes, I'll go back to the table now. And for the final item of this video, we are going to look at the PC that came with the jacket. I am so happy that this is not destroyed or damaged because, again, they do just chuck it in there. The green colour on the back, and it is the exact same style as the other one from the bag. Eight pocket size, square corners, and it's this little concept. So cute! He's doing his little peace sign, has a little strand of hair coming down here, and he's on the photo shoot set for the golden music video. So, so flimsy though, but completely unharmed. Yay. Okay, guys, that is it for this video. I hope you did enjoy and find it informative. I'm so very excited to put all of these little photo cards away. I feel like I've been waiting so long to get some of these cards. I'm so very excited. If you are interested in watching me put away these cards in my binder, please subscribe down below. And of course, like the video if you did enjoy it. And I'll see you in another one very, very shortly. Have a wonderful day wherever and whatever you are doing. Keep streaming golden. Keep supporting the boys in any way that you can, even though they are in the military. It is okay. This is my serotonin boost while I'm waiting for them to come back. I hope you guys did like this video and I'll see you soon. Okay, bye. 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 Hate you, somebody, two cent, two, two, two cent, somebody, somebody, two said, somebody, two said, two said, somebody, two sa, two, two said, said, <laughs> yeah, I can't say, two, sad, two,
Sad. Oh my god. Sad. Too sad. Sad. Why can't I say sad? Sad. I'm I'm really sad. I'm really sad. <laughs> what is going on? Why can't I say that word? I'm saying it with like an accent. I'm too sad to dance. Too sad to dance. In the official video, I'm just going to say sad or sad. I can't work out how to say it at the moment. That's really weird.